Ever wonder why scary stories are everywhere? People just can't resist creepy tales and supernatural mysteries. That's why channels like Mr. Nightmare blew up, getting millions of views and making tons of money. But they're not alone. Channels like Thriller Teller and Whisper Diaries are also killing it. And the coolest part? They're just using simple voiceovers, stock images, and video clips. A teacher like that. As we were doing- Guess what? You can totally do it too. Seriously, no fancy equipment or editing skills required. There's an amazing AI tool that makes scary story videos for you in just a few minutes. Yep, it's that easy. So if you're ready to jump into the spooky side of YouTube, hit that subscribe button and stick around till the end. I'll show you exactly how to start your own scary story channel right now. Okay, to create scary story videos, I will use a brand new AI video generator called Hypernatural AI, an AI video platform that makes it easy to create beautiful, ready-to-share videos from anything. Just enter the idea and get your ready video with custom video styles, consistent character, and captivating AI captions all in just two minutes. I will put the link in the description. Just grab the link and you will be on this page. Now, click on sign up for free from here and then create an account. Once you are logged in, your interface will be like this. This is the prompt box. Here, we have to enter the idea or script. Under the prompt box, you will find some popular ideas. You can take inspiration from here. However, I will start from scratch. First of all, we have to enter the story idea. For example, I am entering an idea about a scary story. A security guard hears groaning from the closed-off basement morgue. He investigates and finds body bags unzipping themselves from the inside. After that, we have to set the style of the video. Here you will find a vast number of styles, including realistic, anime, 3D, fantasy, and others. As I am creating a horror story, I am selecting Classic Horror. After selecting the style, select the duration of the video. Here you will find three options. The first one is a short video, after that the medium video, and lastly videos longer than 10 minutes. That means you can create an extremely long video. For testing purposes, I am selecting Classic or a 2 to 10 minute long video. Next we have to set the aspect ratio of the video. Select a ratio as per your need. After that, you will find a plus icon. Here you can upload audio clips, video, or voiceover script if you already have. As I want to start from scratch, I won't use anything. Now, simply hit the next button from here to generate the script. You can see that the AI is writing an engaging script for us. Our script is ready. This is really quite a good script. I like it. However, if you don't like the script or want to change any part of the script, you can do it by text command only. At the top, you will find some options. First, the narrator. This is the narrator's voiceover. You will find a bunch of options. You can choose any one from here. Next, you can change the video style or create a new style. Just click here, and the style training pop-up will appear. Now, you have to upload a reference image. After that, set the generate button here. The title and the description will be added automatically and you will find three sample images. If you don't like the result, you can regenerate the previews. Once you are satisfied, hit the Save button to save it as a custom style. Our custom style is saved. Now you can set your custom style as the video style. After the style, you can change the aspect ratio. Next, we have character. According to the story, AI created two characters for us. If you click here, you will find a bunch of options of pre-made characters. You can change the character and set it as you want. You can even create and set a new character. This is the character creator interface. First of all, we have to enter the name of the character. Once done, enter the bio. Basically, enter the character prompt. I am entering a ready prompt. Once done, you can add a reference face if you already have a character image. I am uploading this image. Once everything is set, hit the Generate button. And here it is, the character is ready. Now, click on the Save button to save the character in the library. Once the first character is set, in the same method, create and set the second character. Okay, once everything is set, hit the Make Video button from here. 
Now it will take some time to create the storyboard. So, I am fast forwarding the video. And here it is. The video storyboard is ready. You can notice that it creates all the scenes according to the script. Now, you can see the preview by clicking here. Frank had worked the graveyard shift at the old city hospital for 15 years. Nothing ever happened. Until tonight. Another night, another donut. Honestly speaking, I think the video needs customization. Don't worry, we can make it here. First of all, the caption is not captivating. We need to change the style and set a trendy one. So, come to the right side panel. Here you will find a bunch of options. First, with the actions option, you can regenerate all the images, duplicate the video, regenerate the audio, change the aspect ratio, and even delete the video. Next, we have the caption style. Here you will find a vast library of caption styles. Just find the best one and apply it to your video. For example, I am selecting this one. Now it's looking perfect. If you need further customization, then click on scene caption from here. Now you can set the caption position, size and number of lines. To find more options, click on edit caption style. This is the caption editor interface. Here, you will customize everything. First, we have position, then the number of lines, and after that, the background. Next, in the text options, you can set the text font size color outline and highlight color. And if you want to hide the caption, simply click here. Okay, our caption is set, and now it looks so amazing. Okay, next you can add a title and a logo with this option. After that, you can add a watermark to the video with this watermark option. Next, you can change the color. After that, you can set the custom style. Next, we have characters. Then, you can see all the generated images, and then the videos. Next, you can upload media from your device to add to the project. After that, the audio settings. And in the end, we have GIFs or stickers. Okay, you may have noticed that our scene has still images. However, we can turn them into videos. You can do it by simply clicking on the animate button from here. Another way is by clicking on the image option from here. Now you will see the prompts here. You can also change the prompt. After that, you can change the image style. Now, if you click on the generate image, the AI will regenerate the image. However, if you turn on the animate options between Kling or SVG, and then click on the generate moving image, then it will directly generate the video clip. And here it is, you can see that the video clip is ready. And the quality of the video is just perfect. No morphing, unusual movement or anything in the video. This is amazing. I love the quality. Now, in the same method, animate all the scenes. Okay, all of our scenes have been animated. If you want to change the script of any part of the video, you can do so by clicking on the script button from any scene. If you want to add a new scene or delete any scene, you can also do it. All right, now let's have a look at the transitions. To customize the transitions, click on the Edit Transitions button from here. Now you can set the transitions from here. Okay, once everything is set, hit the Export button from here. Now you can share the video with your friends with this link. However, if you want to save the video to your device, then set the video quality and then click on the Start Export button from here. It will take some time. I am fast forwarding the video. And here it is, the video is ready. Let's have a look. Frank had worked the graveyard shift at the old city hospital for 15 years. Nothing ever happened. Until tonight. Another night, another donut. Frank yawned. Suddenly, a chilling sound broke the silence. What was that? Frank wondered aloud. He checked the monitors, focusing on the basement morgue. Sounds like it's coming from the basement. From the morgue? That's impossible, he muttered. Reluctantly, Frank decided to investigate. He grabbed his flashlight and headed down to the basement. Probably just the wind, or rats. Yeah, big rats, he reassured himself. He reached the morgue. The groaning was unmistakable. Hello? Is anyone there? This is security, Frank called out. This is just amazing. The quality of the video is top-notch. It's a perfect scary story video. 
I can say that we can create better videos than Mr. Nightmare using Hypernatural AI. So don't forget to try the tool. Alright, now think. You want to create videos with a specific character. To do that, come to the home page. Here at the top of the page, you will find three options. Video, Character, and Explore. We are currently in the Characters tab. Here you will find all the default characters along with your custom character. Now, if you want to create a new character, simply click here and then create a character as per your needs. Okay, now let's have a look at how you can create a video with a character. To do that, select the character. Now, you can start with an idea, or if you have a script already, click here and then paste the script here in this box. As I don't have a script, I am entering an idea. Just enter the story, settings, and style. After entering the idea, click here. You can see that it generates three detailed ideas for the video. Now select one of them and then generate the script. Once the script is generated, set a narration voice actor from here. You will find a bunch of options. Once the voice actor is selected, click on the continue button from here. On the next step, we have to choose the platform where we want to publish the product. For example, I am selecting TikTok. You can select multiple platforms also. Once you are done, click on Continue. In the next step, we have to set the visual style. Next, set the caption style, color, and logo if you want. Now it will cast our character. You can see that it generates two characters. Now you can customize them. After that, make sure this toggle is on if you want to generate consistent character videos. Now click on Generate Video to generate the video. It will take some time. So, I am fast forwarding the video. And here it is. The video is ready. Now, preview the video and then customize it where needed. Give proper time to customize the video. And once you're done, export the video and save it to your device. And this is our character video. Deep into the night, a shroud of darkness blankets Moonville, an abandoned ghost town untouched by time. Frank, a lonely wanderer drawn towards the unseen, finds himself on its eerily silent streets. As the wind howls through neglected buildings and across the moonlit cemetery, an unsettling chill makes Frank's spine tingle. So now you can create this kind of high-quality, consistent character videos using only the character and the idea and start your journey with a channel like Mr. Nightmare. It's so simple. If you also want to create high-quality storytelling videos and gain quick success, don't forget to try Hypernatural Video Generator. You can start with a free trial. Yes, you can generate five free videos using this amazing AI video generator. However, if you are serious about content creation, you should buy a premium plan. All right, friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear your opinion about Video Ocean AI. Share your thoughts and results in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, happy creating.